hello and welcome now in today's video i will be sharing a few tips concerning online marketing uh, what is online marketing and some few platforms that you can use to sell your items whether new or old online marketing is the uh, an act of using digital platforms to sell your products or services nowadays whenever you think about buying or selling something it is easier as posting it on any platform you wish to looking at it now online marketing is giving land-based market stores a run for their money that explains why quite a number of physical stores have also decided to open websites to market their products and services because the future is online some of you might be asking what will i sell online i don't have a shop uh, or rather i don't have items that i can be selling online the good thing with online marketing is that on some online websites like Gigi, you can sell both used items or new items. Those items you no longer use in your households, you can easily convert them into some cash to acquire new stuffs in your home. Uh, for those who don't have old stuff to sell, you can start arbitrage where you buy products from wholesalers and sell them at a higher price on the digital platforms. Uh, I'm sure, I'm quite sure in your area you might find one or two wholesalers people with good fast moving items at a lower price where you can resell it at a, at a higher price than the buying one hence you'll be making some profit for those who want to venture full time into online businesses you can start with little or no capital at all you'll have to establish businesses or shops with products you you are interested in selling look for products that you know better and you deeply understand how to use it that way it will be easier for you to explain and uh, market your products to client categorized it into three major sections one we have social media we have e-commerce and marketplace all have categorized into those three sections over 80 percent of consumers reporting that social media especially influencer content significantly impacts their buying decisions most social media platforms enjoy large user accounts with data records of it, hence making it a perfect platform to help you get targeted audience for your products and services. Mostly, these platforms, it's free to post your items or sell there. However, there are cases where you have to purchase uh, premium packages for you to get a higher higher traffic on your products or higher number of sales. The premium packages are quite affordable if you are full-time in business. These premium packages put your items in the limelight whereby it will be the first page on the search bar on, on the website according to the website you're doing. Uh, leading social media platforms in Kenya include WhatsApp, which, uh, which enjoys 97% of the population. We have Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. We'll tackle each each of these platforms individually in details in coming videos. So stay tuned here, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any useful information that I've compiled for you. Let's check out the second section that is e commerce. Uh, unlike other platforms, e commerce sites accept orders, text payments, and handle shipping and logistics and provide customer service to clients. The main difference between e-commerce and physical commerce, however, is that e-commerce transactions occur entirely over the internet rather than a brick and mortar location. Most of these e-commerce platforms work on a commission-based transaction, whereby they will deduct a certain percentage on the sales you receive from each order. Mostly the commission ranges from about 10%, 10 to 15%. Some e-commerce platforms will collect the item at your shop and others they will have a warehouse where you you will have to avail your item or product on order. Leading e-commerce platforms in Kenya include Jumia, Kilmall, Jumbo Shop. Jumia is currently taking the largest percentage in the e-commerce website uh, because the of third, popular. third section, that is marketplace. Marketplace derived from the word market. This is basically a website that connects 
sellers with buyers. This means that you post your item, a client who is interested in the item is directed to you. Most of these sites are free and others they have premium packages for you to purchase. Uh, this just the like your local brick and mortar market where you have so many sellers with the same items of different items put in one website where you come and pick the items that you're interested in buying. Once you get an item, they'll give you a details for the sale. Unlike the e-commerce platform, so they handle everything for you. In marketplace, you'll have to contact your client, do the customer service, agree on pricing, do the logistics, take payments, and everything. So most of these marketplaces will benefit from their premium packages that are you will purchase from their site depending on the traffic that you're intended to get into your business leading marketplaces in kenya include currently include uh, gg.co.ke we have pgme we have buy rent kenya we have checky and five uh, we'll tackle individual platform in details in the coming video so stay tuned here subscribe turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any useful information that I have provided for you. That's all for today, whereby we have tackled three sections of online marketing, social media, e-commerce, and marketplace. In our next video, we are going to dig deep in each website, step by step on how to post there, how to improve sales, and some online selling hacks. Thank you for watching this video to the end. See you again next week with another insight on online selling and some business tips that I'll have gathered for you during the course of the week. Thank you. Love you guys. Goodbye.